Angel Reese recently opened up about her struggles to make ends meet on a $74,000 salary in the WNBA. During a candid discussion, she revealed that her salary barely covers her rent, leaving her living beyond her means. And keep paying. I love when y'all do that. What do you say? Hate and pays the bills. Hate and pays them bills, baby. I just hope y'all know. The WNBA don't pay my bills at all. I don't even think that pays one of my bills. <laughs> Literally. I'm trying to think of like my rent for where I stay at. Let me do the math real quick. You might cover that. Yeah, it is covers it, that. It is definitely it, covers that. What is my... I don't even know my salary. 74? Okay. Times... Here, I'll do it. Yeah. I don't even know my oh. salary. Does it? Let me see. You don't even... <laughs> Yo! I'm living beyond my means! <laughs> it's like... Um... No, my rent is more than that. It's 8000 I'm living beyond my means. Like y'all think, babe, if y'all thought, mm -mm. it's like, let me stop. I don't, even, I don't even know my salary for WNBA. That WNBA check don't pay a thing. Do that even pay my car note? <laughs> yeah, I think it pays your car note. Yeah, I ain't doing it that thing. Oh, when is that other hot tea coming out? That's sad because that really shows you, like, obviously you're fortunate to be in a good where situation. you have other I know. streams of income, but think about how many people don't and have to actually live off that. I know. That's really sad. I wouldn't even be able to get a sandwich if I wanted to. If yeah, I, no. You literally I wouldn't be able to eat. I would only be able to live. Yeah. Like, yeah. especially in the city, like Chicago, yeah. New York, like, that's crazy. And and you make the same amount of money if you live in New York, California, which are the most expensive states. I know. Versus if you live in like imagine Minnesota. Where, yeah. Like him and Ricky and them Yeah. Live. Yeah, and their Damn. tax rate is so much higher. And I want to live somewhere safe, so. So crazy. Crazy, crazy. Crazy, crazy. We're going to make more money though. She emphasized that while she's grateful for her opportunities, the financial reality for many athletes in the league can be challenging. In her own words, Angel said, The WNBA check don't pay a thing. I wouldn't even be able to get a sandwich if I wanted to. This stark reality highlights the financial struggles faced by WNBA players, especially in high-cost living areas like New York or Chicago, where the cost of living can be exorbitant. Fans have pointed out the irony in the previous ridicule aimed at WNBA salaries. As Angel noted, while some people have mocked the earnings of female athletes, she's managed to secure additional income streams through endorsements and other ventures. This showcases her business acumen and resilience in navigating a landscape that often undervalues women's sports. The conversation underscores the disparity between male and female athletes' salaries, raising questions about the broader support and recognition for women in sports. It also reflects the need for more investment in women's basketball, not just from fans, but from sponsors and media alike. Ultimately, Angel's story is a reminder of the hard work and hustle required to succeed in professional sports, especially for women. As the WNBA continues to grow, it's crucial to support these athletes and advocate for fair compensation that reflects their talent and dedication to the game. The landscape is changing, and with continued efforts, the future looks brighter for female athletes.